Hey guys, today I am going to show you how to 3D motion track around a corner. Um, here's a quick preview now. Right, so once you've done everything in Bijou and Cinema 4D, where you obviously added your background and the video to the background and you've added your 3D object, it will look something like this when it's fully rendered. And what you can see is that your 3D model is um, not going around the corner. Um, and as you can see, even though it's motion tracked, that you want it to be behind the basically this wall. I'm going to show you how to do that. And the main two things you need are the rendered video from Cinema 4D and the original clip that you use the background in uh, Cinema 4D. So I've got this one here. So it's obviously the clip that I motion tracked and used as an image sequence and so on. So what you want to do is you want to overlay that video on top of your Cinema 4D rendered one with the object. And as you can see, you're not going to be able to see the Jeep or anything. And this is because it's overlaid on top. Now what we do is we event pan crop and you want to hit mask which is down in the bottom left hand corner down here. Make sure the anchor creation tool is selected and you want to basically mask this straight edge of the wall or whatever edge you're, you're obviously trying to motion track and then cut it like that and what you're going to be able to see is that the Jeep is hidden behind the wall there. If you go across a key onto the next frame, then you have to basically move this um, this mast area across. So what I do is I zoom in using the zoom tool. I zoom in onto this little point down here. So basically what you want to do is you want to hit your anchor creation tool, hold control and basically drag it across until it's in line with the fence. And then you go across another keyframe and just do the same again. And basically you do this all the way across until your object is showing, fully showing like this here. So this is just one I did earlier. Okay, and then it just goes all the way across like so. And then that's basically the end of it. You just basically have to, it's a lot of masking, it's a lot of effort, but it looks worth, it's basically worth it in the end, because um, it looks really professional. It's just a lot of work and it can be really time consuming. So that's basically it guys, I mean that's, this troubled me for a long time, but I've basically figured it out. So comment, rate, subscribe, and if this helped you then thumbs up. and.